Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to sync Huawei Health with Google Fit. Before we start, hurry up and check out these offer just under this video. So let's get started. So you might be wondering here, how do you sync Huawei Health here with Google Fit? Well, there are a few things that you may need to understand here. Now, the thing with Huawei Health and Google Fit here is they used to have an option to basically, or you have the option to sync those two apps. But as of right now, they actually move that specific option for us to sync our data, which is something really unfortunate here. But there is still something they could try doing here to basically sync your data across these two platforms. Now, you could actually use the following app here, which is in this case going to be the Health Sync app. Now, what the what the HealthSync app here does is that it actually allows you to transfer data from one app to another app, which allows again allows you to basically transfer your data either from Huawei Health here or to Google Fit or from Google Fit to Huawei. So vice versa. So you want to go ahead and go to Google Play Store here and so go HealthSync here and click on open. Now, what we need to do is we just need to fill up and basically uh, set up or set this up for uh, uh, for our device. Let's go and click on OK here. Now it's going to say sync configuration. You go and read this, but uh, but for now let's go and click on OK. Now from here we want to go and choose uh, the base sync resource. So where the information is going to come from. So if you're syncing from Huawei to Google Fit here, you may want to choose Huawei HealthKit. Now from here, since we want to sync to Google Fit, you want to go and choose the option here for Google Fit. Now by the way, you could go ahead and do this uh, vice versa from Google Fit to Huawei. So depending on what you need, but let's go and click on OK. Now, once you've done that, you just need to click on the declaration of consent here, and you just need to accept the following declaration here. And once you've done that, it's going to start the syncing process. Now, it might take a while, and again, it will actually uh, transfer data from another, uh, from one app to another. So if you've chosen multiple apps here, it might take a while, but in this case, that's about it. So just some information here. This may or may not work for your mobile device, depending on what's the brand or what model you currently have right now. But in this case, you go and try it and see if that works. But in this case, that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.